greetings hello guys and uh yeah like there is a i'm i'm sure that by, by you clicking this video that you have heard about prisma and prisma has been there like in the nodejs or javascript community in the back end especially uh, uh it has been going around a lot and i've tried it as well i have used it uh, prior to this and at first i thought of just trying out right just trying uh, out if if that tool is usable but i have noticed myself that for any project i tend to use this tool called prisma and uh i think by now i think uh i while using it frequently i got the confidence of possibly uh, making a tutorial out of prisma so in our first chapter so there will be several videos and they are uh, uh, categorized in chapters so first we will be the overview similar to this video and we are going to have in the next following video what is actually an rm some certain concepts why do we need to use rm in our project or in, the, in our backend and then as well we are going to do in the next chapter introduction to prisma we will introduce some features of prisma that will be in the schema migrate and client anything that is regarding prisma so anything that is uh, really amazing or standing out in prisma uh, on this orm tool another thing we'll do in the next and the third chapter and last chapter would be relationship in prisma so anything that is regarding tables um how to relate between tables one to many one to one uh, and and much more so that would be it and possibly we'll be have a fourth chapter and the fourth chapter maybe would be regarding uh, a complete project maybe possibly so but for now we will have those three chapters overview introduction to prisma relationship in prisma so what do you need to do or when you, what do you need to install or have is node.js above 14 some coffee like usual <laughs> we tend to uh, as developers we tend to drink a lot of caffeine it's all right it's all right and i'm not judging you i'm drinking as well at the moment some coffee time and i'm sure that you'll be uh, amazed by this prisma tutorial prisma uh, tool and i hope as well the tutorial <laughs> so yeah uh some time coffee and no js over 14. So what I'm assuming during the videos will be that you already understand Express and Node.js and we are going to use Express and Node.js including TypeScript as well. So um, you don't have to know advanced TypeScript stuff as, as I, I don't know as well. You could just uh, know that you could add it. Like if you understand what the concept of TypeScript, TypeScript is, then yeah, you're good to go. And then we could run it. Most of the times we'll be re doing Express and Node.js. So I recommend you to go through Express with uh, like the Express framework uh, that is on top of Node.js. Another thing we'll be doing is we will add some REST concepts. So if you understand Express, so I'm assuming that you already understand REST concepts as well. So yeah, these are the th things that I'm assuming and the chapters that we are going towards to. And yeah, and then for next following video, we are going to talk about what is an ORM. Yeah, take care. <clears throat> I'm not sure why, but I tend to forget a lot of like so, every time some certain uh, topics. And one of them was I wanted to showcase, okay, this uh, I'll sh I'll send the description yeah, in the description below. I'll s I'll add the links for the uh, Prisma to documentation. And another thing is, since we are doing some coding or development in the other videos in the, the chapters, uh, I made a um, GitHub repo and I'll send I'll put the link as well and in the description below, where uh, all these concepts will be inside there and they will be the branches will be categorized as chapters so there will be chapter one chapter two and chapter three so that will be it so you could check it out this term uh, this prisma tutorial to check out the code how we are doing it but you could try that on your own with the video that i'm going to do and you could follow step by step with me or, or, or if you're thinking, if you're into coding to see more of the code, you could check out the branch and I'll send that link in the description below. Yeah, I think I didn't forget anything now. Yeah, goodbye.
take care <clears throat>